Hello friends, this is Rahul. Let's simply learn robotic process automation with UiPath. In this video, we will extract the handwritten text from image and cursive text from the image using Microsoft Vision activities. Let's open UiPath Studio. Name it to process. Extract handwritten text from image. Open a main workflow, click on a sequence. Now to use Microsoft Vision activities, we have to add those activities. For that, go to the manage package, click on all packages, type uipath.microsoft-vision. Yeah. then click on install click on save click on accept now these activities is present these activities are present under integration then Microsoft, then Vision. These are the activities under Microsoft Vision package. So in this, in our case, we will use handwritten text activity. For that, we will drag and drop in sequence. Before that, to use handwritten text activity, we have to use Microsoft Vision scope and under microsoft vision scope we have to put handwritten text activity yeah now let me show you the images that we are going to extract the text we have first image that is present in the cursive writing let me zoom it yeah you can see this and another is handwritten which is written on a paper. Let me close this and copy this and then put it into our project folder. Now close, refresh it. Yeah, images are present now. So to use Microsoft Visions activities uh, we have to provide service URL and subscription key so to get the service URL and subscription key we have to go to the Microsoft Azure account you just log in into your Microsoft Azure account and click on create resources and simply type computer vision and then click on create then your key and subscription URL will be generated. I have already created. So let's go to the Rahul computer vision activities. Yeah, this is my key and endpoint URL that the same we are going to use and provide here subscription key. This is should be in string. That's why it should be in double quote. And then we are going to use and one URL that is service URL. Okay. Uh, now here we have to provide the path of the image. So we'll select the image here from our image folder and then hand return. Click on OK. Yeah. Now here 
read highlighted text activity we have a property called more here you can select handwritten or printed in our case we are selecting handwritten now our next activity would be we will use one right line right text file activity yeah before that we will create one variable for handwritten text activity in out under output text which is a string type control k and output text so this is a variable you can see the variable is created we'll change this change the scope of variable to sequence yeah uh, we have already added write text file activity here we'll provide the output text variable and here we'll provide the path where exactly we want to store the output file here i'll just name it output text and save it yeah that's it in our flow let's run it and see the output before that uh, i'll use one right line activity just to verify whether it is successfully executed or not to see the out uh, in a output pen text dot to string yeah save it and let's run it Yeah, execute execution started it's done you can see uh, extract handwritten text from you started then whatever text is present and end it now let's see the output file yeah and our handwritten text file is let's compare both yeah exactly the same whatever it is present you can see all these things exactly is the same whatever present in the hand image and the whatever we have extracted yeah now let's remove let's close this let's remove this file contain from the file and save it we'll use another file which is present in the cursive writing yeah select it open save it and we'll run this again let's wait to finish the execution yeah it's done refresh it open the output text file yes great it has ex extracted let's open the image yeah you can able to see here whatever text present in the cursive writing that has also clearly extracted properly extracted and plus uh, put it into the text file here something machine learning or with algorithm being used whatever present in microsoft azure whatever created by microsoft and present in microsoft azure yeah that's it in this video thanks for watching please subscribe